In this video, I'm gonna teach you three easy DJ tricks in five minutes starting now. The first trick involves slip mode and you can think of slip mode as a mode where you can do anything to your track without affecting its original playback. The thing is, most DJ controllers don't have this mode. Luckily, I've made mappings for the DDJ400 and DDJ200 which will enable you to easily use this mode. So stick around till the end of this video to learn how to install it. Anyway, how do you use slip mode on your DJ sets without emptying the dance floor? Well, it's pretty easy. You can either use a backspin before a song reaches its drop section, or a vinyl break stop during a track's buildup, or trigger other cue pointed sections in the song. Or even baby scratch a beat if you're feeling bored. Now before you go crazy with slip mode, just remember that less is more. So when you use this trick, use it sparingly. The next trick involves using the echo out effect. And this effect can smoothen out your transitions. And can save your mix if you botch up a blend. So here's how to get this effect on Recordbox DJ. And here's how you can get this effect on Serato DJ. The trick to making this effect work when mixing out from a track is to activate it at the last 4 beats of a song right before you completely mix out. And the final trick involves drop mixing. And this trick is a great way to keep your EDM mix fresh and to keep your audience on their toes wondering what the next song will be. So the first thing you need to do is cue point the drop section of your current song and next song. Now when you play your current song, ready your next song via its cue pointed section. Then when you reach the current song's cue pointed section, simply stop the current song and play the next song. Oh yeah. If you want to make this trick sound smoother, try activating an echo effect on the current song right before you stop it. Oh, yeah. So with these three tricks explained, let's move on to importing the slip mode enabled mappings to Recordbox DJ. And that's it. Which trick was your favorite and why? Let me know down below and put a star emoji in your comments so I know who you are. And with that said, thank you so much for watching everyone and I will see you all in the next one. Yeah.